motherfucker! That's what you got for me? Yeah, he does. He shot, Jeez, you're gross. He shot a thick of fluvial stream at your general crotchal area. Gotta make sure. Gotta make sure. Okay. Well, I got 94 of these fucking things. 90 fucking four of them. Yeah. That's a lot. Good year, 94. Uh, the rebirth seems to be going real well for you guys. Yeah. Your re rebirth. Everything in here I is evil. I bet you if the uh, Unitology rebirth didn't go too well. They'd be like, okay, that didn't go well, but next year we'll have a dream match. We'll need a bigger bag for next year's rebirth. Look at that! Left! Left, left, behind uh, you! I know, I see Why it. Why is it? I see it. Break fuses. To get into Overwatch. Alright, now I made a little... I made a little, uh... Loop to loop. Loop to loop, I guess. So I could backtrack to the backtrack to the gift store. Wait, have I been here? I don't you know if you actually have. Yes. Yeah. This is the loop to loop that I made. All right. This away to the indoctrination seed section. Yeah. Like you were meant to be part of something bigger. Than not nope, really. Not really. No interest in that. Did you ever feel like you're meant to put a purple bag on your head? Yeah. And just lay down and wait? What? Why did that just explode? A lot of things are exploding, to be fair. I guess it felt left out. Oh, hey, man. What up? Oh, it's been too long in this VR machine. Ugh. I gave up. Indoctrination test phase. Desire to socially belong is high, unassertiveness is low, so is gullibility. Tolerance for ambiguity is high, cultural disillusionment is low, idealism is high, susceptibility to trance-like states, low, self-confidence high, desire for spiritual meaning, low, awareness of group influence on individuals high. Subject is highly unlikely to stay affiliated with the church after a short period of time. We'd expect him to exit the system after the tithing requirements section of initiation. We should invite him to go as far as he'd like, but do not... Book future earnings against him. That's another uh, highlightable word that you want to keep. You, the tithing? Yeah, you want to keep that out of the literature. It scares people off when they hear about the tithing. At least for a few levels. When you've reached a level 7 zealot or a bard or whatever in Scientology. Did you just say a bard? Yeah, I sure did. I pulled a fuse out. I'm a level 3 Scientology thief. Wait, what? <laughs> How do I... You'll figure it out. I think you already figured it out, maybe. Oh, I did. Because I gotta get that fuse over here. Yeah. Wait, over where? Over there. Wait, look at this. Look at this fucking this annihilatable platform. door. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. Imagine it. We all get unified all into visceral goo. Mm -hmm. With one purpose. With one mind. Mm -hmm. With one soul. Ooh. No war, no fear, no hate. What about it love? Like or conflict? Or, or uh, good times? Or rational thought? Oh my god! Did you, you have to turn into Ghost Rider? I saw it! Damn it! That must have been a hard slide for them to get the space Photoshop guy to make that. <gasps> He'd be like, really? Is that what you want to happen? <laughs> really? The guy's just staring at his desk for like two hours, just like, what? Well, okay, what's happening here? Explain I can't pull the thing out anymore. I don't think you can. I think we're supposed to put another, uh, Oh wow, okay, I guess you can, never mind. I pulled up. Uh, there you go. Uh that's the that's the good one. That's the good one. And you gotta put the other one in the top one. I, top one doesn't have a battery. 
Okay. Find but it. The... You lost it. Do we get the Ghost Rider shot again? No! Harry, you gotta complete this task so we can see the Ghost Rider It won't thing. leave the room. I tell you, put it in the top thing. Wait, the top thing? The top, like, battery slot on the wall. Oh my god, I'm blind. I didn't see that at all. Then fine, get up to this thing so we can look at Ghost Rider. Damn, oh, it always restarted. Oh shit, never mind, there's no time for that. Yeah, there's time. You I got this. Head. I got this. Excellent work. You guys think you're good, huh? I love that all the furniture gets Actually, blown out. Gone. That's super cool. That door seems to be having a problem. I did it at the wrong time. Just, just do a roll underneath it. Come on. Oh, I thought it was killing me. Yeah, I thought it was too. Pick up items while the scary shit happens. Yeah, who cares about that shit? You're mad about our breakup, huh? Is mad that because you killed yourself? You know what I mean? Remember you that episode where Isaac Clark accidentally drank uh, Nicole's breast milk? Oh man, how awkward. <laughs> mad about you, Isaac. It's the only episode of Mad About You I have any from memory of. Oh man, what do I want? This, uh, okay, security. Get some milk barn stuff. Get that shit in here. That's what we're talking about. All of you get in there. Look at those baby coffins. I see it. They're coffins for babies. It'll help them rebirth. Yeah. Are you serious? All right, here we go. It's insensitive. To so I'll be able to get the security suit next time. Yeah, yeah. Which is awesome, because I could use some more inventory space. Crawling fuck the around. fuck the defense boost. I need inventory. Crawling around. Now get out and face the wall so I can be attacked. <laughs> wow. Why'd you take your helmet off for this moment, uh, Isaac? Can you is, see his face? Is it because you're crazy? Oh, no, well, because if she was attacking with a syringe, probably, probably couldn't go through his helmet that easy, huh? Yeah. He took his helmet off so he could kill himself. No, she must have pressed the button. No, that's not a real thing that just happened, Matt. It's a ghost. It's not even a ghost. It's all in his head, man. Then he pressed his own button. Yeah, he did it to himself. Okay. Because he's a stupid. Why are you stupid? He's like, I'm going to get that, Nicole. No, yeah, you're right about the inventory space. It's getting real bad. Getting real bad. I also see there's like Mortal Kombat statues. Like, you know that statue that Reptile jumps out of in the Mortal Kombat movie? I do. Look, them. The, there's them right there. I see them. They look creepy. I, will, I hope Mortal Kombat Reptile doesn't jump out. That'd be really awkward. Why are you laughing now? Uh, reptile. I remember it's like the first moment I like was cognitively aware I'm getting hyped. Yeah. Was that? I'm getting so excited right now. Like just because I didn't know Reptile was gonna be in the movie. Yeah, no one did. And then when they showed Reptile in the movie, I should have saved that, up some money. When he was that bad CG chameleon thing, and he's just running around, he looks like shit ass. And then when he shows up and he's regular old reptile, I was like, Oh, Paul W. S. Anderson, you're the best filmmaker in the world! The best! And that remained true to this very day. I would like the security suit, please. <sighs> so you make fun of him, but that guy has three awesome movies to watch. Wait, what are they? Uh, Mortal Kombat. Yes. Uh, and the other two I don't know. Event Horizon. Oh, Event Horizon's really good. And then, uh, Soldier. Oh, he made Soldier! Yeah. I wouldn't call that awesome, but it's pretty fun. It's, okay, fair enough. And that's it. So now I have 10% armor. See, this is a suit I like. Yeah. Because the helmet looks fucking cool. Uh, I don't think this is the same one. Uh, maybe it is. It's close. <sighs> He's my little Giver boy. I had to sell a bunch of my ammo to get this. That's fine. It's worth it. You look sharp. 
How much ammo do I got? I have plenty. I have 53 shots. That's more than enough to kill anything that's dead. Do you think they should ever, um... They should ever, like, try to reboot this or make another one somewhere? Mm. It'd have to be, like, a new story at the very least. It can't be just Isaac again. Well, Isaac... Isaac doesn't have any stories left in it. Okay, fair enough. I don't know how... I don't know how they would do another story after what they did with Dead Space 3. You know how Mass Effect 3's ending was so fucking bad and, like, far-reaching mm -hmm. that they had to go to a different fucking galaxy to get away from it? Yeah. Dead you have to outrun that ending. Dead Space 3's ending is like that. Okay, fair enough. Where it's like... Oh, very bloody in here. Take, uh, take your word for it. Hey, this is a nice little office. Yeah. Oh, this is where like I came out of. Yep. Yeah. It doesn't look like a bit more tech was installed in the RE4, like, castle. Sure doesn't. Look at this fucking great room. Oh, I remember this great room. Look at everyone really hyped for the rebirth. Yeah. Clever girl. Reptile. Well, you're right about reptile. <laughs> you remember this fucking thing? You remember this room? Yes, I, yes, I, yes. I fucking remember yes, it. Yes, yes, now, now I know exactly what happens in here. Yeah, it's fucking cool. Cool ass shit. Why should not trigger it? Like, oh, it has to. Yeah, like there's a bug or something. Oh man, no, get your bugs out of here. This area is actually tough, so. Look um, forward to it. Look forward to me fucking it up because I'm talking. Hey, so, did you see, like, after we talked about how I love it when game anybody goes, please look forward to it in game magazines? Yeah. And, but I hate, uh, it's, it'll be done when it's done. Yeah. Like get today, Camilla goes. Like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. And you were talking about that concern you were looking at that said when it's done. Yeah. Like, like you got fuck fucking you. one two punched. I got a, I got a bit of love and then I got a bit of hate. Okay. Please look for it to Dead Space Rebirth. Whoa. They are locked out. In game There's magazines. In the it broke the door. Hang on, I'll try to override all the gates in the area. No, actually, don't do that. There's something on here, too. Don't, don't override all the gates. <sighs> okay, I've opened up all the security gates. Oh, wait, couldn't you have... Well... Shh. Fuck. I fucking hate these fucking motherfuckers! Oh, nice. I don't think I can open her out! <laughs> <laughs> so these fucking things are clearly Jurassic Park or Velociraptors. Yeah, they have that sort of leaping uh, gait. Fuck. Fuck. Fucking noises, man. Fucking fuck these things. You fight them again later, and the second time is way tougher. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm not Oh, there's another one in here. I think so, because you would have another conversation or something would unlock. And they're and then and, and, and like you said, there are clever girls. Like Fuck you. And the lab. You there? Isaac, I can't unlock the elevator. You were quite rude can to me before. Let me see what I can do. Okay, once you're through, you'll go through the funerary ring of the church and down to the crypt. Oh, the funerary ring! Great! Great. Great. What no, could go wrong in there? You'll be going into the sacrificial acid bath. Oh, you're gonna go into the area they keep dead bodies so they can dump it into the big convergence pit. Oh, awesome! There's something really crass about it just being the convergence pit. Yeah, just like, dump it. It might in as well there. be the the convergence dumpster. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much what it, it is. It is. But if they use that 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 verbiage, like they're just like, and and after that, you'll be, you'll be brought to the funerary pit. Uh, I mean dumpster. dumpster. I mean I mean hole. I mean shit. 
Like, you know, you know, in from Dust Till Dawn, right behind the titty twister, there's this huge death pit where they throw in all the bikers and truckers that have come by. Yeah. If you walked 15 feet closer past the past the titty twister, just, just poked your head over, you'd be like, hmm. Mm. That's a death pit I can get into after the titty twister thing. And that's what I'm talking about right there. Open this shit up. Okay, that just opens me back up to to uh, the store and the gift shop. I think this is the gift shop right here. Unitology. Yeah, let's get some gifts. I heard a lot of noises. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I hear them too. <laughs> <laughs> I have four. Which means one, two, three. Yeah, in yeah. that order. Uh, Fuck yeah! Got all the damage. Next thing is the the fire thing. Special. Which I don't know if that hurts them at all, but I mean that's cool, right? All right. Light them on fire, like. Oh, there's another damage one. Yeah. I missed it. Oh well. When I get two more. When I get two more. You're still on the path this, that you this chose. This fucking gift shop music is freaking me the fuck uh, out. Uh, Welcome to the gift shop. Oh, Convergence Dumpster! Uh, yeah, Perry White slash fucking Paul Amer are gonna be selling us on the Convergence Dumpster. Yeah. You'll be reborn! Like, okay, Perry. It's WWE reenacts Michael Altman's Attention. Jesus Prophet. Alright, how many people are gonna attack me in this fucking room? All of the people. Isaac Clark is like, please leave me alone, I was just doing my curious. <laughs> yeah, that worked. Yeah. He's very angry you killed the little ones. So manic. Get off of me. Alright. Is there another one in there? I guess yeah, not. Yeah. Alright, guys. Blasto. Let's see if I got the timing right. I didn't. Because they don't seem to want to move. Yeah, just blast them. They don't like that. Really? Seriously? Yeah, seriously. Fuck it, I guess we'll just do this the hard way. You got lots of help. Fucking god. And it's like you really like you do have to kill every single enemy to like progress. In some cases, yeah. No, that's that's just garbage. That's what I think of that shit. Death is a blessing, wow, idiots. Oh fuck. I fell. I'm falling. I'm still falling. Well. Oh, that movie. Oh, make Yeah? Look at his leg. Yeah, it's doing its thing. Let's just leave it alone. I guess let's just leave it alone. Maybe, maybe the elevator door will crush him. Now don't disturb him! Damn it. Yeah, his leg was gonna- Yeah, yeah, it close it. Damn. Ah. Idiot. What a fool. What a goddamn stupid fool. Ah, <sighs> just a little breather. Yeah, just a, little, a nice little chill out moment. So we can chill out. I wish like a big, uh... Monster would just punch through the wall. I was wall gonna say me. TV would flash space cereal like Unitology O's. Oh yeah, friendly. Rebirth crunch. Why is it wet in here, guys? Yeah, we didn't fix the plumbing. In your religious corpse? Pool? I'd like I'd like that type of like uh, union style plumber. 
to be like, ah, we're all gonna be, uh, converged into one, so I'm not gonna fix that. I don't give a shit. The fuck you give a shit? Think I we'll give a shit? We'll all be united. Ah, uh, so what if I'm a little wet and I'm united? I like being wet right now. I'm I sweaty. Look at this shit. I didn't feel like it. Ah, uh, it's cold in here. That's why it's wet, I guess. Wet is cold. It's like a dry cold. Yeah. Yeah, I kind, of, I kind of remember this room. Every single one, of, it was the demo also. Yeah, I didn't play the demo. Oh, yeah, you did? It's like every single one of these fucking tubes could come out and attack you. Try and steal your Pizone. You gotta get into the Pizone zone. Yeah, that's right. Ah, not a single one attacked me. That's to soften me up for the jump scare later. Because now they're out. There you go. Oh! That was pretty good. That was pretty good! Pretty good, kid. That was pretty funny. Wasn't this the dumb thing that they tried to expand upon in Dead Space 3 where you would see things that your co-op partner would not and you'd, you'd, you're you supposed to fight each other or some shit? I, don't I know. honestly don't know. I honestly... Honestly don't know. Okay. Though that'd be a cool ass idea, right? I think there was something like that. Like, hey, why are you shooting at those enemies? And you're like, I have to kill these enemies. They're like, what enemies? Like, that's cool, right? Yeah. But in terms of gameplay, then your other your friend's not doing nothing. Well, in terms of gameplay, the co-op partner might be imaginary. <laughs> he's well, I don't know if in single player. Remember with that was the era partner. of like add a dude bro space marine to your game. Whatever your game was, just throw the the space marine dude bro in there. Yeah, there's something right there. Oh, a text log. Uh, software glitch caused the thaw and loss of two bodies last week's comeback. We were able to switch to the majority of section one over to manual control before any significant rise in temperature. I still suspect the EarthGov officers were denied access to the crypt last week or somehow responsible. May prove to be otherwise, but the timing of the visit and the error was too coincidental. We'll reformat the operating system, I guess, and eliminate any chance of infectious software. I'll pull a triple shift and sure all triple goes shift, well. Geez. Triple shifts for real. Still nothing attacked me. This is a good build up of tension. Might uh, make it might happen if you have to go back through here. I don't think I do, but no, but you know what I mean. Like, yeah, I do know what you mean. Yeah. What do you got? Ah, fourth one. And it's the exact same layout. Yeah, weirdly. All right. Okay. There you go. It's a good habit in these games when you kill an enemy, immediately look to any other entrances that enemies could attack you from. They like they like to sneak up on you. Because they're, they're jerks. smart. They're not smart. They're very intelligent. They're crafty. They uh they can solve complex puzzles and riddles. Oh man, I can't even solve complex riddles. <laughs> oh man. How embarrassing. If I ever have to go on a quest where it's like, eh, run away from things, or like, jump over a thing, it's like, I could probably handle that. But if I get to a thing where like a sphinx, or like, I don't know, something that has big titties, would be like, solve my riddle three, and I'm like, oh. You're like, I don't know. I don't fucking know. Like, can I use my phone? They're like, no, <laughs> lol. <laughs> You're like, damn it. You're like, really, Sphinx? Oh! Shit. That's a good attempt. Fuck nice. this. Alright. Nope. Oh. There's more fun to be had. Come that on. That was good. You know, honestly, I'm surprised that you, like, I was just looking at this game for a second as you were showing that last guy. I was like, this looks great. Still. Yeah. I'm surprised he hasn't, like, been like, fuck it, just triple pack all three games on modern consoles and a new, uh... Bam, PC. done. It's weird. 
Maybe they're too embarrassed by Dead Space 3. <laughs> Three? Yeah. They'll just be like, yeah. the real Dead Space, and it's Dead Space 1, 2, and Extraction, and then they'll make Dead Space 3 again, and they'll just call it Dead Space 3, and it'll be a completely different game. That'd be awesome. Wouldn't that be fucking ballsy? Yeah. Or Dead Space 3, the real story. I mean, if Sega's, Sega has enough balls to be like, we're not even gonna count Sonic 4, even though we called it 4. That's really nuts. That's super crazy. Um, see, I think it's in like the the never-ending story where the stupid kid has to solve a riddle by these two sphinxes that have these massive sweater cows, and they're fucking like nude. And I was like, how is this kid not losing his mind? Really? That's your yeah. <laughs> like, uh, he's like 13. Like, how is there? How is he not being like? How can he handle this? <laughs> how can he handle this fucking shit. Guess I'll just have to fix it. It's almost like an, I'm an I'm an engineer or something. I fucking got my masters, Christ. Masters in space engineering. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that, that thing's shit. cool. Look at that thing. I don't know if you can hear me. Do you need to go up? Go down? What's that? Ripper! Nice. That's my boy. That's my good boy, Ripper. And you shoot the center? No. You do something. Isn't it you, you, you put a build up of something in it? Like you make it spin out of control? Like, yeah, oh, press no, that, then, then slow it down. There we go. Let's rip it up. And one more. There we go. Oh. Uh. Right. I have to. Okay, now I remember. You. St Dases it, and then you, you... You do something. You move these. Yeah, you TK them. Okay. That looked like shit. Why? What do you mean? You stabilize that shit. And then two more in lockdown. Yeah. I think you're gonna have a little fight -o soon. I thought I heard a scary growl. Yeah. I also thought that. So far, no scary... I think it's just the machinery, but that's the genius of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's that other one. Oh, no! Stop that! This one. And quickly now. With all due haste. I'm such a scientist nerd, you guys. Look at this fucking science nerd thing that I'm doing. Look at that. No one's ever seen this before. Shit's crazy. Congratulations on your singularity or whatever you did. So I'm going to guess that robot machine just turned off the gravity. Or Definitely don't want to just fly up there. Definitely don't, Mega, maybe. Oh, I got to call that. got to fly up there. Really? Can you stasis it? Yeah, I can, but still, I don't like it. Well, I don't know what you want me to tell you. Uh, <laughs> no! Perfect. All right. No, nope. you get no in. Can't let me in. Nope. It's bringing down a space coffin. There you go. Whoa. Yeah. Fucking, Great. Fucking dope. Hey, look at that shit. Medium med pack schematic. Don't mind if I do. Yeah. I can't wait to get the schematic on a bench. Damn it. I think they're jamming out signal with a mobile device. Someone get me the frequency on that jammer. Who are you working with? They must have a gunship positioning the compound. Now what? Change your plans? No. If they knew where we were, they would have killed us by now. Oh, shit! Signal fading! 
Okay. Hurry. Her message is to hurry, do it faster. But... Ripper. I need to buy my Ripper. That's great, lady. I'm gonna buy my cool shoot bangs. It's an industrial cell. Don't worry about that. I'm gonna sell that. There's many things that are not used for weapons primarily, but you can definitely use them to be weapons. Definitely. Like this thing. Where is it? I didn't see it. You did it. Yeah, you got it. Oh, I love you, Ripper. Well, it's much more impressive when you use it. Yeah. Trust me. Trust me, ladies. It's much more, more impressive when, when, I, when it's it. being used. When it's in its when it's docked, not as not you know, as I'm cool gonna admit. As, I'm gonna admit. Yeah, but. it could use some work, but uh, you know, trust me on this. It's uh, it really really cuts really, it real, um, real good. It really there. has its time to shine. What are you doing this boring shit? It takes I, ages. I guess. Oh, I can't wait to get this fucking medium schematic for a health drink. I already did that. Oh, I missed it. You did too you fast. Did, I did, I did too fast. Alright, I have two. Damn. Put all the luck into the Ripper. All oh, fire is terrible. I hate it. What does it do? It just fires the thing like a gun. But it's like, I don't need that. So this one, actually, duration is just as strong as damage. Because mm. you, the whole thing about the Ripper is you can kill an enemy with one shot. Right, right, right. Yeah, I remember. Why don't you save up your Ripper progress? Yeah. All right, let's save up my Ripper progress. And rip and tear in here. Yeah. 